Hello and welcome to this Dr. Osmas key skill video on identifying prime numbers. So we've got a list of numbers here and we want to work out which of those numbers are prime. Now let's think about what the definition of a prime number is. A prime number is a whole number whose only factors are one and itself. Now hopefully you've already viewed the video on what a factor is. Remember factor is a number that you can divide something by without a remainder. And basically what a prime number represents is a number which is not very divisible. So let's just say, I don't know, you're trying to form some netball teams uh, from your friends. Um, if you had a number like say 13 friends and you want to split them into teams, that would be a really awkward number because you can't divide 13 up in a nice way. If you had, I don't know, 15 friends and you could have three teams of five or five times teams of three, it's more divisible. Whereas prime numbers are not very divisible. You can only divide them by one because any number but you can always divide by one um, and itself, which you can divide any number by itself. So those are kind of exceptions as factors. So we need to look at these different numbers and consider which of them has no factors other than one and itself, because then it will be a prime number. So let's take a really small number. Seven is prime, because if we list all the factors of seven, well, the factors of seven are, well, 1, because 7 divided by 1 without any remainder. We can't divide it by 2, we can't divide by 3, we can't divide it by 4, we can't divide it by 5, we can't divide it by 6, and we can divide 7 by 7. Now, the only factors here are 1 and itself, 7. So this would be a prime number. Now, looking at these, let's consider different numbers it might be divisible by. And the numbers I would try are dividing by 2, 3, 5, 7, and then you want to be absolutely sure you could check 11. So divided by these numbers, I mean, it's not divisible by any of these numbers, then it's probably prime. It might have a factor which is larger than these numbers, but it's unlikely. And in fact, with large numbers, it's often difficult to tell whether they're prime or not. So we're only going to deal with smaller numbers here. So 95. Does it divide by 2? Well, it's not even, it's an odd number, so it's not divisible by 2. Does it divide by 3? Well, let's try that. 95 divided by 3. Well, 3 goes into 9 3 times, exactly, and 3 goes into 5 once, remainder 2. So it doesn't divide exactly. 95 doesn't divide exactly by 3 because we have a remainder. So it doesn't divide by 3. What about 5, though? Well, if any number ends with the digit 0 or 5, then it's in the 5 times table. So it's a multiple of 5, and therefore it's not a prime number, because if you can find a number it divides by, other than 1 in itself, then it's not prime. So it's not prime, because it has a factor of 5. OK, 29, is that a prime number? Well, let's try these numbers again. So does 29 divide by 2? No, it doesn't, because it's an odd number. Does 29 divide by 3? 3 goes into 2 0 times, and then you're going to do 3's into 29, which goes 9 times, remainder 2. There's a remainder, so 29 does not divide by 3. Uh, let's try 5. Does 29 divide by 5? Well, the last digit is not 0 or 5, so it doesn't divide by 5. What about 7? Does 7 go into 29? No, it doesn't. 28 is in a 7 times table, so 29 is not. And 11? Is 29 in the 11 times table? No. And therefore, 29 is prime. What about 26? Well, 26 is an even number. It means it has a factor of 2. And because it has factors, other than 1 itself, it means it's not prime. So it has a factor of 2. It has other factors as well, so it's definitely not prime. What about 11? Well, does 11 divide by 2? No, it's odd. Does it divide by 3? Is 11 in the 3 times table? No. Is 11 in the 5 times table? No. Is it in the 7 times table? No. Uh, well, 11 divides by 11, but that's itself. So 11 is prime. Remember, prime number still has factors of 1 in itself. So 11 does divide by 11, but it's itself, so it doesn't count. And finally, 21. Does 21 divide by 2? No, it's an odd number. Does 21 divide by 3? Yes, 21 does divide by 3. It goes in 7 times. So therefore, it's not prime because it has factors of 3. It also has a factor of 7 as well. So that one is not prime. 